today I'm gonna be sharing with you my all time favorite hair care products. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Besties and welcome back to my channel. My name is Hannah if you're new here I am so excited for this video because I get asked all the time on my TikToks and my reels what hair care products I use before we get into it If you are not already following me on Instagram and TikTok be sure to do that My username is at Hannah Whirling and let's get started So I feel like the backbone of any hair care is going to be the shampoo and conditioner that you use I absolutely love this one. It's from love beauty and planet. This is their argan oil and lavender sulfate free shampoo I will show you guys a little close up of what this bottle looks like. I know that they have smaller ones as well, but I just really like the bigger bottle because I have a lot of hair, so I need a lot of shampoo and conditioner each time I wash my hair. What I really like about this product is that it's 93% naturally derived, which is amazing, and also I feel like it doesn't strip your hair completely of the natural moisture that your hair has. I feel like with a lot of drugstore products, when you put it in your hair, it feels like your hair gets really dry after use, and this feels really different to me. I know that they also have a matching conditioner of this as well that I also use and I really really love and you guys I have to say this stub smells so good I don't think I've used a product in a long time that smells this good it really smells like you're taking like a nice calming like relaxing bath or you're going to bed and you have you know like a pillow spray on it or something like that I feel like the ingredients list is pretty short for a shampoo and conditioner which I really appreciate if you have a super long ingredients list I feel like you can get a lot of harsh chemicals chemicals and things like that in it and then also I am getting my hair dyed for the first time since quarantine started so my hair is quite dark at the roots right now and I just want to get it lightened up with kind of a warm blonde balayage. What's great about this is it's a sulfate free shampoo so you don't want to be using a shampoo or conditioner with sulfate in it especially if you dye your hair because it can strip the color and it can make it not as bright or colorful so I definitely recommend if you do dye your hair like me use a sulfate free shampoo always. After getting out of the shower I always recommend using a microfiber towel or just a base t-shirt instead of your regular towel on your hair to dry it just because a regular towel can make your hair really really frizzy and if you are like me somebody who has frizzy or wavy hair already it can just make everything worse after it's all towel dried and everything like that then I like to use a leave-in conditioner this one is the not your mother's curl talk leave-in conditioner if you are somebody like me who has really frizzy or wavy hair I definitely recommend using a leave-in conditioner with this stuff you do not need very much because I feel like there's a lot of oil in this product so I would recommend only two sprays on each side I know that it's great for people who have a weave or curl pattern like myself this one also has no sulfates in it which is amazing and there's also no silicones which is really really great there are products out there that will make your hair feel very very soft even if you have frizzy hair however they have silicones and that can just build up on your hair over time the other thing that's amazing about this product is it's also a heat protectant so I use a lot of heat on my hair as you guys probably already know I straighten or curl my hair pretty much every day so that requires a lot of heat protectant and having something like this on your hair can really really help make sure that your hair stays happy and healthy the next product is my holy grail heat protectant I have been using this for literally years probably since I was in high school this is the Tresemme heat tamer I absolutely love this product it is so good now I know that this is just a basic drugstore product I believe this is about seven or eight dollars maybe at Target or any CPS but I have to say it is so so good I feel like there's a lot of heat protectants that can make your hair feel sticky or oily and this does neither of that I feel like it sprays on super super light it evaporates very quickly and it just does a good job of keeping my hair protected protected again. I have used heat on my hair pretty much every day since I was maybe in middle school or high school so I definitely recommend this product to anybody who uses a lot of heat on their hair like me. There is nothing wrong with loving drugstore products. I know that a lot of people can't afford kind of the higher end products so I definitely definitely recommend this. Pretty much anybody can afford it and it is really easy to find as well which is amazing. The next 
next product is one that probably everybody knows at this point. This is the Tresemme Hairspray Non Aerosol Level 4. I really, really like this product as well. It does a great job of keeping my hair in place literally all day. If I do not use a hairspray, my curls will literally fall out probably within an hour. I'm not sure why my hair does that, but everybody's hair is different. So if you are somebody who really needs a hairspray, if you're going to curl your hair, I definitely recommend this. I'm gonna give you guys a, another little close up of the bottle just so you can see. Again, this is another super affordable product that you can find at pretty much any drugstore. I have also been using this product probably since high school and it works so, so well. You do not necessarily need to have really, really expensive products to be able to have something that does the job and works. And I've never found that this stuff really builds up or anything like that. If I wash my hair out, I don't feel like my hair is sticky the next day or anything like that. This is also great if you want to do a slicked back ponytail or slick back buns, definitely recommend using a really great hairspray. After I use heat, I always like to use a hair oil on my hair. I use a hair oil probably pretty much every day as well, just because I feel like it helps add that moisture that maybe got lost from using all the heat on your hair. So this one is from Coco and Eve. It is the Like a Virgin Miracle Hair Elixir, and I will show you guys a close up of what this one looks like. So this product was actually sent to me by them for a little promo. TikTok, but I absolutely love it. Look how small this bottle is. It has lasted me so long, you guys. I don't even think I've used half the bottle up because each time you use it, you only need a few drops in your hand. So it has amazing ingredients. It has coconut and hyaluronic acid in it, and it also protects to up to 220 degrees Celsius, which is amazing. Again, especially if you do use heat as well. You can also put this into damp hair. So prior to blow drying or using heat on it, you can put it in. And the other thing I love about this product, it is crazy lightweight. So with a lot of hair oils, I feel like they are very, very thick and it's easy to put too much on and get your hair to be super greasy. Especially if you're someone like me who washes their hair every two days. Sometimes I even wash my hair every three days. So I do not want anything that's going to make my hair feel greasy. And this definitely does not. You just put a few drops into your hand, you rub it together, and then you kind of pull your fingers through your hair especially just towards the ends. And then any leftover, sometimes I'll apply it just to the top to kind of pat down any flyaways and it works absolutely amazing for that. So the last product I wanna show you is from Fanola. This is their NutriCare Restructuring Fluid Crystal Serum. This stuff is, again, also amazing. I have probably used it for about a year now and look how little has been used. It's only this much of the bottle. Again, you only need a few tiny, tiny little pumps. It is a more expensive product, but because you use so little of it, it will last you for literally years, just this one bottle, so it's totally worth it. As you guys could probably see, this is a little bit of a thicker serum, so again, I would recommend using a small, small amount putting it in your hands and just rubbing it together, particularly on the ends of your hair. With this stuff, I would not recommend putting it up towards the top of your hair just because it is a little bit thicker and a little bit more oily. This is also a product that you can apply to damp or dry hair, so I like to use it after I use heat. However, you can put it in your hair right after you get out of the shower. It's really, really amazing. I highly recommend this product. If you are looking for a little bit more of an investment product, I think that hair serum and hair oils are great just for the health and longevity of your hair especially again if you are somebody like me who dyes their hair it's really really important that you're able to maintain the moisture in your hair and serums or oils really really help me to do that so that was all the products that I want to show you guys today I want to thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed seeing the products that I use on my hair I will be sure to link them all down below for you guys if you have not yet subscribed or checked out my other videos already be sure to head over to my channel and see that I have more hair care fashion, skincare, and more, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!